Hi, I'm going to explain the Tinkercad challenge that I'm giving to third, fourth, and fifth graders. This is an optional activity, but I do have um, a 3D printer here at my house now that I grabbed at school when I got the opportunity to go in and get some other things. So I can actually print a few things now. So the challenge I have for you is to watch the Brain Pop video on coronavirus or the brain pop video on distance learning and learn what you can and then go and decide what you're going to do. And your challenges are the things you can build is you could build a coronavirus model. You could build, uh, you could design a, a backpack tag um, that you could put a clip on like um, a carabiner or, or something and hook it to your backpack or wherever you wanted to hook it, which is a slogan for um, keeping you motivated while you're distance learning or keeping people motivated to follow social distancing or say thank you to um, first line workers who are working so hard to keep us safe. Or um, you could build uh, a design that you could glue a pin back to to make a pin um, for that. So in Tinkercad, I'm going to show you what I mean. I'm going to click over here and you can see here I've played around. I've created a um, coronavirus model here that I just goofily created. Please don't replicate exactly what I did. Do your own thing. Um, over here is that backpack tag. If you're going to make a backpack tag, remember you need something to hook that clip to. If you're going to make something that you could glue, hot glue gun a pin back to, um, you could do that. Remember, anything you make, every bit of it has to be connected. It has to have a solid flat base. It needs to be sitting on the ground. Nothing can be sticking through on the bottom. So you can see here's my coronavirus model that has a base. Um, here's a backpack tag I made, stay home, save lives, and I made the I, the dotted eye is a heart, and this is a, a surgical mask uh, saying thank you healthcare workers. So your choices are pretty good. Um, I'm not going to really limit what you build, but it does have to have kind of some, some connection to what we're all going through right now. And uh, if you submit that to me by May 10th and it's printable, I'm going to do my best to print them out. And then I will rub them all down with Clorox wipes or cleaner and stick them in the mail and try to get it sent to you. So that is the 3D printing challenge that I'm giving to you. So it's to design something related to that coronavirus or distance learning video and to submit a printable design to me that I can start running. So. Have fun with that. And once again, this is optional if you like Tinkercad and you want a project to kind of sink your teeth into to make something really thoughtful. Um, I hope a lot of Huskies try and stay safe, everyone.